We did this uh, a couple, three weeks ago, whatever it was, and uh, everybody seemed to really enjoy it. And so uh, it's some more 90s trivia now. Sweet. The last round we did was all music, 90s music trivia. Mm-hmm. This is like kind of all over the place. It could be music, television, movies, you know, any kind of like uh, pop culture type okay. of stuff. All right. News could be news. All right. Mm. You know, things like that. And so we'll run it just kind of the way we did last time since that worked well. In the, uh, in the weakest link mm-hmm. fashion where I'll just uh, go around the room with the questions and we'll just see how you guys do with the 90s trivia. All okay. right. All right. So you got a minute. Got All it. Right. See how many, uh, how many you guys can get right. All okay. Right. Yeah. And uh, this these were not uh, AI generated the way that menaces were that one round. <laughs> mm-hmm. Who's the richest woman in the world? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Don't know. Nobody Tom knows. Hanks won his third Oscar <laughs> for which movie? Uh, what? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm saying that it's too hard. Terrible. Yeah, what? <laughs> All right, so we have uh, '90s trivia. Who wants to start? Greg. In this round. Okay. Uh, Greg. Okay. All right, All right. Greg's gonna start. All right. Greg. All right, here we go. Greg, what was the name of the principal in the TV show Boy Meets World? Oh, Mr. Feeney. Mr. Feeney in the show Full House. Ravi, the Olsen twins shared a role for the youngest daughter. What was her name? Michelle. What was the largest grossing movie in the 90s, Seabass? Titanic. Titanic. What was the name of the popular handheld digital pet everyone carried? Sammy. Tamagotchi. Yep. Barbie Girl was the song by what artist, Menace? Uh, Aqua. Yes, you guys are killing it. (laughs) The jeans brand, Judge None Choose One, was better known as what, Gregory? Uh, guess? Junko Jeans. Oh, Christ. How many Spice Girls were there, Ravy? Five. Easy for you. What TV show featured the internet's famous dancing baby? That would be Allie McBeal. Allie McBeal. Man, you guys are good. Except for Greg. <laughs> All right, uh, Sammy. What was the name of Simba's father in The Lion King? Mufasa. Menace. What was written on the bottom of Woody's boot in Toy Story? Uh, uh, uh Max. Max. No, <laughs> Andy. Andy's name. Andy. Uh, All right. Yeah. I believe we got breakfast. Yeah, well, I mean, you guys oh, get yeah. breakfast either way. Nice. Yeah. Uh, it's Jenko jeans. Jenko, whatever. Yeah. J N C O. Jenko. Junko, yeah. Jenko. Yeah, Before I would not start... have got that one, Greg. No. Well, Before it's, people it's, start texting in, it's the acronym. It's right yeah. there. Yeah. Our initialism. Uh, all right. So Fun. that's uh, that's one round of that. You want to <laughs> see? <laughs> yes. Got some eight more. I got some uh, more questions. Double Ooh. breakfast. All right. Not double breakfast. Uh. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> we, we just want triple breakfast. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, are we ready for round number two? Yes. Oh, yeah. Round number two. Here we go. Greg Gorey. Yeah. Name the TV show where one of the characters had a catchphrase. Did I do that? Uh, that would be Family Matters and Urkel. There you go. Uh, let's see here. Ravy. Mm-hmm. What was the name of Ross's pet monkey in Friends? Marcel. Marcel. All right, uh, Seabass. Who was the coach of the Chicago Bulls during their dynasty run with Michael Jordan and Scottie Pippen? Phil Jackson. Phil Jackson. Uh, Sammy, Nick Carter was a member of what boy band? Backstreet Boys. Uh, what movie had the famous line, you can't handle the truth? Menace. Uh, stand and deliver. A few good stand men. Stand and deliver. <laughs> uh, what was the name of Whitney Houston's chart-topping song from the Bodyguard soundtrack? I Will Always Love You. That's right. Ravy, who was the host of MTV's Total Request Live? Carson Daly? Yep. Menace. I'm sorry, Seabass. This Snoop Dogg album included the hits Who Am I? What's My Name? Murder Was the Case and Gin and Juice. That would be Gin and Juice? No. Doggy style. What a dumbass. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Idiot. God. I like to change we my so well. answer to doggy style. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> With two G's. Mm-hmm. How yeah. many did we get on that one? Uh, like I 20. Keep track. I'm not keeping. A lot. I'm, I'm getting you breakfast either way. I remember yeah. my friend got dog. But Menace style. is looking for triple breakfast. Yeah, triple <laughs> breakfast. <laughs> triple breakfast. Yeah, still at one. All right. Uh, here we'll, we'll do a we'll do another round here. Nineties <gasps> trivia. All right. Uh, who? Oh, Seabass. No, Seabass mm-hmm. was last, right? Yes. All right, here we go. You are the weakest nope, link. Goodbye. No, we're not doing that. Bye. <laughs> okay. Oh, man. Here we Bye, go. Sammy, what Nirvana album would you find smells like Teen Spirit? Uh, pass. Never Ouch. mind. You should have said never mind. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Menace, the phrase as if was made popular by what 90s movie? Oh, that's uh, Clueless. Clueless. Who was named the first female Secretary of State in 1997? Albright. Battle Albright. Ravy and Beavis and Butthead, what band is featured on Beavis's t-shirt? Um, Metallica? Metallica. Rip. Noise. 
Uh, what Nickelodeon show started the careers of Nick Cannon, Keenan Thompson, and Amanda Bynes? Seabass. That would be all that. All that. And some burgers. Uh, Sammy, what's the name of the first cloned sheep? Oh, Ooh, good question. Uh, Dolly? Dolly. Oh, nice. Look right. at that. Menace, who sang the song Mambo Number no. 5? Oh, uh, Beanie Man. Beanie Man. Lou Vega. Lou Vega. <laughs> Gregory, what movie had the famous line, I see dead people? Six cents. Six cents. Nice. All right. Breakfast. Nice. Double bre- triple triple breakfast. Triple breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> nice. What should, our, triple breakfast. what should our three courses be, man? I think yeah. Yeah. Donuts start. or muffins and yeah. stars. Yeah. Okay. Surf and turf. Yeah. yeah. See, this is this is why um, Cameron <laughs> made the question so difficult. <laughs> yeah. When he did it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know. Because he omelets. wasn't about to buy. Bre- I'm see. I'm buying you breakfast either. Even if you'd not gotten any of those correct. Uh, you couldn't come up with Nevermind from Nirvana. I don't know anything about Nirvana. Wow. Who's yeah. the lead singer? Um, Kurt Cobain. So you oh, know okay. That's the, that is the one thing. That I know. <laughs> Who's the bassist? Who's the drummer? Who's the drummer? And I know the naked baby on the album cover, but oh. I don't know the name. How big was that baby's penis? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, show us with your fingers. <laughs> about me. About me. About, about me. Yeah. yeah. Uh, all right. We can do another round. Yes, back. yes, yes. Okay. All right, here we go. Menace. Which company made the incredibly popular Beanie Babies? Oh, that would be uh, Ty. T-Y. T-Y. That's yeah. right. Captain Stephen Hiller in Independence Day was played by what actor? Greg oh, Gorey. crap. Will Smith? Will Smith. What was the first rule of Fight Club, Ravy? Uh, don't talk about Fight Club. Don't talk about Fight Club. <laughs> uh, Seabass, what was the butler's name in The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air? Wimsley. Incorrect, <laughs> dummy. It's Jeffrey. Oh, oh stupid. I, I, yeah. I forget to watch that. Wimsley. Joffrey. Sammy, who said, what's in the box in seven? Matt Damon. Matt Damon is incorrect. Brad Pitt, Detective David Mills. <laughs> uh, what city did the Simpsons family live in? They didn't say the city. Springfield. Yeah, Springfield. Springfield. Sorry, they didn't say the state. Every. They didn't say the state. They don't don't have a last name? Yeah. (laughs) My bad. (laughs) Uh, Greg, what was the name of Hanson's first single? Mm Mbop. Mbop is is correct. What was their follow-up single? (laughs) They did Uh, have one. Good question. Yeah. That's a a good question. Do not know. They still tour. Don't they have like 98 kids? Yeah. They're very, uh, are they Mormon, right? Yeah, they're... They're very fertile. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Let's All right. See. God, they have like 10 albums. <laughs> Damn. Really? They yeah, do? They have a following. Yeah, they they do have a music. following. Yeah. I see Sammy being a follower <laughs> of Hanson. <laughs> They're probably one of those bands that we would hear not knowing it's them and like it and, and then find it's out good. it's them. Go They'd like, ah, oh, that sucks. I will right. come <laughs> to you. Was, was the, there a follow up? Was the follow up. Hmm. The one that charted, really. All right. Uh, 90s trivia next round. We are starting with uh, with Ravy on this okay. one. Ravy, here we go. The comedy sketch show in Living Color was created by which Wayans brother? Keenan. Keenan Ivory Wayans. Seabass. Which short lived 90s beverage contained floating colored balls? What? Ball Coke? Hmm. <laughs> Orbits. We Orbit. were talking about Orbit. that. Okay, yeah, I never had that. Okay. All right, Sammy. Who sang Whoop? There it is. Oh, uh, Snoop. Tag team, back again. <laughs> Snoop. <laughs> All right, Menace. Good in, guess. in 1999, scientists discovered that HIV-1 originated from a virus from which primate? Monkey. Chimpanzees. Gregory. Woody. Which hella cool American hip hop duo popularized wearing clothes back to front? Oh, crap. I can't remember their names. Uh, the scrotums. The scrotums. Crisscross. <laughs> That's it. All right. Uh, Animaniacs was featured. Uh, characters from what studio? Disney or Warner Brothers? Warner Brothers. Warner oh, Brothers. Easy I didn't even peasy. need a choice. Is <laughs> correct. They're still live in that water tower. Yeah, they do. Uh, yep. They're kind of dead now. No, they right. just had a new uh, They just had a new season. resurgence. Yeah. Yeah. yeah geez, Menace. Where? All right. On Hulu. Oh, okay. All right. Uh, we can do one more round. <laughs> We have time, yes, we have please. time for, for one more round. I could right. be here all morning. Yeah. <laughs> I play games. Let's see here. All right. Uh, Seabass. Here we go. Tevas were an awesome trend of the 90s, but what kind of footwear are they? Shoes? Sandals. Okay. Uh, Sammy, in 1990, Kuwait was invaded by which country? Russia. Iraq. Oh. Oh my God. Uh, Menace, who retired as head coach of Notre Dame football in 1996? Oh, uh, uh, Rudy. Rudy. 
<laughs> Lou Holtz. <laughs> he talks like this. Gregory, which actor oh. rose to fame playing Joey Potter in Dawson's Creek? Joey was that chick that was married to Tom Cruise. I can't think of her name. Uh, boobies. Boobies. Katie Holmes. <laughs> All right, Johnny Depp dated which British supermodel after they met in 1994? Ravy. Um, Easy. Uh, I have no idea. Kate Moss. Thank you. Uh. All right. Who said or saying that? The truth is out there. Said. That's Fox Mulder. The X-Files. Yeah. Got it. That was All a right. rough round there. See, that one was... Uh, yeah. Yeah. And I'm reading the questions too slow. I'm already buying breakfast. There's no, like... <laughs> We don't yeah. get quadruple breakfast. You're not getting quadruple breakfast. Yeah, <laughs> you want this, slow is, question this is just for the this is just for the uh, exercise of '90s trivia. Thank you. Exactly. It keeps it moving along. Well, uh, <laughs> yeah. So uh, you guys did did really well. We made the questions, I think, a little bit more, um, you know, reasonable. Yeah, I, I'm yeah. with Menace. So I could play this all day. Yeah. It's so fun. Yeah, and it's a lot easier, by the way, because people are like, oh. I've gotten every single one of these. Yeah, I have. Yeah, well, when you're not on the spot like that, yeah. Yeah. It, is, uh, it is much easier. We're playing hey. for bagels. <laughs>